All right, peace family. It's your brother Kimante. I know you can barely see me, but this is the video I wanted to make outside. I had to come in my car though, just to feel secure. Cause these cops still around me, you know what I'm saying? I think they're leaving out now, you know what I'm saying? But they still here as of right now. So I, I wanted to at least get in my car and make this video, you know, within my little, my, with my ownership. This is what I, this is my car. So I can be in here as long as I want. I can do what I want to do. You know what I'm saying? I can talk how I want to talk. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, I live in Clayton County. I live in Riverdale. And um, these cops, they're going to one right here going to pass me right now. These cops, um, they continuously antagonize us. Like, mate, this shit is sickening, dog. Like, dog, nigga. Like, I come out my door. Actually, I just checked out my window and I saw, I saw, I saw, I saw, I saw like, a little, the police lights. And I already knew what it was because they do this shit damn near every fucking week or every other week. Now, like, it's like, it's crazy because they only come in our communities and do this. They only act like this to our communities. They only, you know, put these cops over here in our communities and have them roadblocking the whole time. You know what I'm saying? Every time somebody come down the street in the car, they're going to pull, they, they want to get their license and, and check for their, you know, registration and just trying to figure out ways to get people tickets. That shit is whack, bro. And it's weak and it's punctified and it's just, you know, bro. I just seen a video, by the way, of, of some of five kids, um, you know, lined up and the cop pulled a gun out on them because he thought he thought they, they stole something from the um from the store or something. But regardless of whether or the fact the bro stole something, or they stole something or not, because that's what people people like kids do that, bro. We all stole something before. Does that mean you pull a gun out on him? Does that mean you got to kill him? Like, come on, because I feel like at this point, you know, being a Muslim, we don't believe in carrying guns. It's almost as if you have to get a gun. Like, it's almost as if if you don't have a gun, you know what I'm saying, you're at risk of a police doing just what they do, you know, pulling out a gun on you just for stealing or because they, they thought you stole something. But let me educate on educate you on why I won't get a gun. I believe, and my granddad, my grandfather always tells me, who these pussies go right now finna leave out and leave in our neighborhoods. But look, they were just sitting stationed out over here for like a good fucking 30 minutes, maybe like 20 some minutes, just pulling people IDs and shit. But anyways, I, I just had to point that out just because I've been doing this video for like at least two minutes. But I, I ain't catch the whole time they was out here. They really be on the street. They on, on the, in the same spot too. In the same exact spot. But anyways, imagine somebody lives in that house. Nobody nobody live in that house over there. But what if somebody did live in that house? A nigga wouldn't even want to live in this house. Every time he he he, he check out his window, y'all outside parading in front of his house. Like anyways, let's get back to the original point. And I forgot what I was what I was trying to say, but let's let's get back to the central point of, of what I why I made this video. And um, you know, what I thought about those five kids, you know, you know, oh no no. That's what I wanted to tell you about the gun and why I don't carry a gun. When you when you when you carry a gun, when you and you feel like a gun, you know, has power and you believe in that gun, you relinquish any power God has, you know, to protect you. You know what I'm saying? You're basically saying, I believe in like I believe I don't I'm not no longer trusting in God to protect me from my enemies. But now I'm trusting in my own and I'm trusting in this gun. You know what I'm saying? And you know what they say, you live by the gun, you die by the gun. Or they even say that, or did I make that up? <laughs> but regardless of whatever the fact is, you know, I just want to make a little quick video just to, just to show, you know, the, you know, the type of treatment we get over here in Clayton County where I live at, you know what I'm saying? I start off the video walking to my car, and I thought the cop was telling me, yo, yo, like, I can't record them. So I stopped recording just to make sure, like, make sure I'm good, because I don't want to be on camera trying to do a video. And they could pull up on me on some crazy shit. I wanted to make sure I was straight. So I, I stopped recording for a little bit. So I could, you know, peep the scene out and see what was going on. I'm not sure if he was talking to me or not. Because he ain't, he ain't, he ain't addressed me. He ain't coming to me or nothing like that. But the simple fact of the matter, like the like the, the central ideal of this and the central um, plot and point is that um, we have to, and I repeat, we have to get our own policing. You know, I know we a lot of us got our own security firms and, and blah, blah, blah. Is it illegal to make your own police business? Like, have your own, like, back in the day, like, when the Black Panthers and shit was around? Like, is it 
illegal to start a business, I mean, start a policing business where you have your own people carrying guns, they license to kill. I'm pretty sure it's illegal, but I don't know. If, let me know if you made this far, this far in the video and if that's illegal, because we got to start doing that, bro. Like, this is becoming fucking ridiculous. Like, when when they do shit like this, it's when you need to call your police, like, call our black police, our black force, and be like, look, hey, they going, they over here trying to police our area again. Can you come down here for some backup, you know, j just in case anything go left? You know what I'm saying? Then you could you could approach them on some shit like, you know, because they arm, you arm, you know what I'm saying? So it's equal, it's equal grounds, equal footing, you know. But regardless of the matter, um, you know, I just... I just do not like this, you know what I'm saying? This is this is this is this is not a great, you know, situation to be in. Or it's not something it's not it's not a great um like this whole system and this way like what baby said, the way of life has to change. You know what I'm saying? The way of thinking has to change. You can't change nobody how they feel about you. If they if they if they don't like you, if they racist, they're gonna be always racist. Unless, you know what I'm saying, they just have a change of heart. But that's really, really hard to do. But um, it's just at this point, it's almost as if, you know, the next steps include, it has to be like some type of, you know, organizing on a, on a way where we can actually have our own police force, have our own this. Because it's enough talking about, it's, not, it's, it's, it's hard enough trying to talk to them. You know, it's really, to be honest with you, it's no talking to them because they be wanting to kill you without you saying anything so don't let alone saying the wrong thing and they kill you for the key you for that so it's like we just got to have our own shit like everything our own government our own police force everything our own businesses everything you know but it's your brocky monte i ain't gonna make this shit too much longer i don't really ramble at this point um i mean you could probably barely see my face i don't got i got my mirrors up and whatnot i'm in my car it's late I just had to make a video when I saw them police out there. But I'm going to make another video with better light and just to talk more about this. And as I said, like I said, peace family. See you on my next video.